Hi everybody, this is 33 Readings and this reading today is going to be for Gemini. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Let's see what are the messages that pop out for you, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Let's see what are the messages. This may or may not resonate. If it doesn't, you can check out your other placements. But if you have Gemini and your Sun, Moon, Rising, this could resonate. Ooh, that shuffle was clean. Okay. Let's see what are the messages for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Knight of, ooh, Knight of Cups and the Eight of Wands fell out for you right off the bat. Gemini, what are you up to? <clears throat> Looks to me like a love offer is coming your way and it's coming rapidly. It's coming fast. Fast paced love offer coming your way. <laughs> now, I don't know what that means. Looks to me like you're dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Oh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sag. Okay. I think that there is somebody who's going to, somebody who is going to be reaching out to you. Okay, there's somebody who's going to be reaching out to you and the love offer that's coming your way seems to be very, very heartfelt. Okay, coming straight from the place of love. That's interesting. That's interesting because I saw that before. Gemini, you could be focused on your work. I just see you enjoying yourself, your life at the minute, okay? Uh, you could be celebrating something, an achievement, okay? Something that you might have achieved recently, something that you might have gotten, um, okay? Uh, your, 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 <laughs> your main focus is completely on your own work and your own stability. Get your person's energy okay so your person's sitting there wondering about you gemini this person's coming in towards you with i feel like this pace is very very fast okay this person um somebody's coming towards you who has a touch of like um uh, you know somebody who who's very independent confident and usually they're single or they like to stay single. So a person like that is coming in towards you. On the other hand, I see a low financial stability as well for you, Gemini. Right? Somebody is coming in towards you. Like, I completely see that. And I also see that some of you are losing hope, okay, regarding a connection. Uh, because your focus has been on your work. So regarding a love connection, you, you've not been very hopeful. Maybe you haven't communicated with somebody in a while. And it's going to come unexpectedly. Yeah, page of uh, page of wands, six of pentacles and the high priestess. Uh, Pisces, Aquarius energy. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Aries, Leo, Sag energy. Look at that. So this is communication. This flipped out on its own. There, there, there is somebody coming in towards you, Gemini. Okay. Now, on the other side, also what I'm getting for you guys is money. Money coming in or opportunity that's going to be presented to you from an unknown source. Known or unknown. Uh, I do see your money improving or you being presented with an opportunity that you can grab right then and there. I'm telling you. Uh, I see good money for you and I see you rec getting recognition for some sort of a work that you might have done. Um, I already see you being in that state of attracting abundance and feeling powerful, completely focused on your own thing. And I feel like you are not indulging in uh, pointless BS these days because you feel like you've got a lot to do. You don't have time for things like nonsense. I mean, star and the high priestess together. To me, this looks like you haven't been the most hopeful about a connection. However, the person, like whoever is coming towards you usually just stays very, very silent. They are not much of a talker, this person that you're dealing with. But now they're coming back or they are going to be giving you some sort of a communication here. Okay. That's interesting. Oh, that page of cups. Do you see that? Page of cups. 
Let's see. Okay, so Gemini, there hasn't been much. Yeah, I do see that there hasn't been much communication here between you and this person. And that has been a problem, okay? Because you feel like if somebody loves you, they should be pursuing you, right? But th th this person hasn't really pursued you in a while. I see a love offer coming your way and I see fast-paced changes happening in your life. Like your life, if your life hasn't been going good, your life is completely going to take a U-turn, okay? I see a lot of changes. Just change is the word that I'm getting for you. Um, some are slow, some are fast-paced. However, I feel like the communication or the pace between you and this person has been slow. There have been some issues um, between the two of you that have been left unresolved. You look at that page of cups and the page of ones together. That's that's legit communication and a love offer and a new way of uh, coming towards you, okay? So you might be shocked when this person comes in. I feel like this person is very flirtatious. There is a touch to them, okay? Like a touch of flirtatiousness. I don't know. What, what, what am I saying? Flirtatiousness? What, what? Is that even a word? <laughs> okay. Tell me more about the person Gemini is dealing with. Tell me more about the person Gemini is dealing with. Tell me more about the person Gemini is dealing with. The world. So the pace is slow, but they're still coming in towards you, Gemini. This is somebody, I feel like this is somebody that you're dealing with who's got their thing together money wise and like they're very successful or just they've got their thing together okay they are they're very passionate and they're very optimistic something about them is very charming okay but you've been focused on your own thing too right um this person's coming in there's like there's a there's like a comeback around and another chance of you two reuniting the moon in the reverse okay so this person i feel like in this relationship things were hidden from you or this person was hiding things from you in the past and you expect them to you expect them to open up to you more this time around you expect them to be more honest with you in a relationship okay that's what you're expecting and hoping. Like if this person comes forward, I think that you're going to be asking them where, like, what the hell, you know, or just you expect them to be honest. <clears throat> and that's the time. That is the only way you're going to be accepting them in. Otherwise, I don't think so, because you've got your own thing going on. And there are other things as well that you're dealing with. Gemini, you don't have time for that. This person's a little egoistic, okay, a little bit, with a touch of charm to it. Oopsie, something uh, completely fell out of the blue. I'm going to see what is it. Ten of pentacles in the outcome for you. Are you kidding me? This fell on the floor for you separately, just one card. So Gemini, I was getting all throughout this reading that your money is going to be very, very good. Look at this. This is you sitting on your throne. You could be a male or a female. Doesn't matter. Gemini, this is you sitting on your throne. <clears throat> okay. With that big coin and abundance and prosperity growth with your pet by your side. That's so cute. Um... And you've got your thing together. I feel like some of you have definitely achieved something. A lump sum of payment. Uh, you, you've bought something like a land or a house or new furniture. I don't know. You're feeling yourself. Something that you have done in your life that you're completely feeling yourself. And other people are feeling you too. Okay. You could be having a lot of, you know, conversations with your friends. Okay. But I just see you being in your energy of like this, this, this great person who's celebrating something. Um, yeah, and you getting recognition for something. And your life is headed in a very positive direction. 
there is somebody who is coming in towards you with love. Okay, not to forget the outcome was the Ten of Pentacles. Happy family, happy money, happy money, happy finances. Okay, look at that. A lot of financial abundance. Like, I, this is a good love reading, but more than that, this has turned into a financial reading for Gemini. I love it. Gemini, your money and love both are looking good. Um, that's amazing. You know, I feel like this is a time if if you've been wanting to start a business. I don't know why. I see some of you really want to buy a house or I see you putting a down payment for a place. Okay. Something very stable and very profitable for you. Um, and some of you are spending a lot of time with your pet. If you have a dog or a, I don't know. If you have a child as well, it could be a child because I do see children. I just see like a house uh, and prosperity. So if you've, if you've been thinking about in, investing or starting a business, Gemini, you better do it because this is a time that you're going to get good rewards for it, okay? Because your life is changing. I'm telling you, in terms of your money, your money or the sta stability, uh, how, do I, how do I say this? You're going to be more stable in the time to come money-wise right that's interesting okay be careful be careful of envious people right because when you are this successful when you get good things coming in your way people can be envious at times the same ones that are here like being your friends can turn into your i wouldn't say enemies but you know backstab you so be careful of people using you for their advantage and be careful of getting stuck in 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 the trickery that people may present in front of you gemini this is something this is your advice to be careful with who, who you deal with and who you trust in terms of your business as well as your friends around you and there's something that you need to let go of and this is i feel like this is already you transitioning from a messy place in your life to a more calmer water I just see you transitioning um, this is you moving from a place of mess to a place of feeling calm feeling feeling successful letting the past burdens go even though the burdens are not that small but you're still letting things go which is great 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 energy i love this reading just you have to be careful okay you have to be careful gemini any messages for gemini sun moon rising and venus signs any messages for gemini sun moon rising and venus signs oopsie okay i'm gonna pick three any messages for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs? Okay. Any messages for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs? Any messages? Any messages? Oh my God. I think I would have to pick one by hand because none was falling. <laughs> Why wasn't it falling? Any messages for Gemini? There we go. Children, see, your love life is being affected by children. Some of you have a child with somebody or you're spending more time with somebody like a child, okay? Worth waiting for divine timing is at work in your love life. See, I think everything in your life is working out in your favor, Gemini, okay? Everything in your life is working out in your favor, okay? Maybe you will see it, maybe you won't. It's just not about your love life. It's about everything, I'm telling you. Divine timing is at work in your love life as well as your financial stuff. Okay. Codependency. Addictions are effect affecting your romantic life. Maybe you were codependent on somebody who was sneaky as hell. So that's why you also got that seven of swords. Be careful of the sneaky human being. 
this could be a card of codependency something that you're not really able to let go of easily so you have to be careful this came in your advice too that you have to be careful with who you invest your time and energy into and what are people wanting out of you and are you willing to give it to them or not and you know because when you are moving towards the success when you are feeling good calm and happy and abundant people try to you know ruin it for you be careful with that so codependency um yeah try to try to let go of hopelessness and things that no longer serve you okay so that's about it those were the messages that popped out for gemini i love this reading <laughs> really i did um give this video a like and subscribe to my channel this is 33 readings take care and bye bye